morning. It is Wednesday, March 2nd. I know yesterday I said it was uh, like February 29th. Sorry about that. Not a leap year. <laughs> no, yeah. So yesterday, <laughs> yesterday was uh, March 1st. So uh, last night we made it to mile 22.9. I think I said we were on Blood Mountain. There again, another mistake. We haven't hit Blood Mountain yet. We, uh, sorry if that wind's, wind's picking up, but uh, we, we stealth camped last night. Uh, we, we were gonna try to make it to Lance Creek, but a fella named Jimmy in the parking lot who works with well, he helps out some guys slack packing. Was saying that there were going to be a lot of people at uh, Lance Creek, so we decided to try to find a spot beforehand. Sorry, I'm breathing a little bit, but um, yeah, we had a good day yesterday. We probably went 11 miles, so we have. 8.4 miles to go to get to uh, Neil's Gap today. So we'll be on the uh, other side of the uh, bear canister requirement place. So that's that's about what we're gonna do today. So we'll see you, see you along the way. Here it is, we made it to Blood Mountain Shelter. It is Blood Mountain. I think I was tasting blood on the way out, but nah, not really. But we made it. Made it to the top. Right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's go take a look. May as well. Uh, now, I understand this. Blood Mountain got its name from a uh, from a big battle between two uh, Native American uh, tribes. I think the uh, Cherokee was one, but I don't know the other one. I can't remember it. But anyway, that's how it's got its name from from that battle, Blood Mountain. So uh, this is it. We're gonna continue on. As soon as we take a few minutes break here, of course there's other people up here too, so. And this is the view from uh, Blood Mountain, the uh, shelter up here, Blood Mountain. It's gorgeous. Can't tell, I don't know if you'll see it from here, but. I honestly thought so too, I got told that at the. Down there, I'm not sure what that is. Blood Mountain is gonna be your first big obstacle. Down there. Looks like a little town or buildings or something. Boy, I don't know. Don't know what it is. We'll find out. We made it to our first big milestone today on day four. Made it to Neil Gap. And uh, I don't know if you can see it, but I'll give you a better shot here. You can see where all the sneakers are hanging up. Or the sneakers, all the hiking shoes and hiking, hiking boots. And, trail runners, all of them hanging up. This is, this is, I'll wait till this guy gets back. So this is 30, about 31 miles, I think, 30 miles in. This is where a lot of people uh, call it quits. And, and this is what they do, throw their, throw their shoes up in the trees. Not us. Oh, I am hungry for a pizza, though. It's kind of cool. It is, isn't it? So, as many probably already heard, this is the only place on the trail that actually runs through a building. So we're gonna walk through it.
so we're going to try to find a place to camp. Uh, I'm guessing not there. But uh, we're going to find a place to camp and then we're going to get something to eat. So uh, this is the end of our day today. It's about 3 o'clock. Uh, not a bad day. Uh, we did about 8.5 miles. But this is where we wanted to be. So we'll see you in the morning.